God, I don't get the rhythm. Sometimes I do. Sometimes I don't. Like that. Like how... Starting to stick as it usually does. I don't. Fuck it, I'm done. I'm done. I'll do that on my own time. It's probably boring to watch, but I don't get the timing on it. Sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. It's gotta be because my ache fucking button is sticking. This controller is only a couple months old. God damn it. I cannot believe how fast my controllers go to shit. Like, already. Already. I barely use this fucking thing. It's insane. Insane. It's pay $60 for it and it's already going to shit. Alright. So this is where I was trying to go to before. But it looks like a whole lot of nothing. No, this is the way I was trying to go. <laughs> they have soccer? That's cool. I see, so you dribble, kinda, with it. Oh, you fucking clown ass. Ah, oh, screw you then. And you can dash kick it. That's interesting, but not where I need to be going. All well, the other options are down and then right. I've been going in a counterclockwise direction so far, so let's keep that going. Yeah. I guess I should check out the uh, other areas now that those switches are flipped. Or maybe I sh don't need to care about it too much. Come on, you effing a hole son of bitches. Son of the bitches. Patronize me, you fucking robot. Prick.
Looks nice and shitty over here. Like pretty much every area in the game. <clears throat> Dilapidated and busted. Oh, I gotta do the right side first. Fine. Jesus. Jesus! Wow, that's how you travel, though, for sure, if you can keep it going. Dude! Dude! Come on. No, it's because my button is sticking. God damn it. I guess that seems a little better. Did I use this thing? God. All right, Redibu three. Sons of bitches. <clears throat> yeah, it looks like this all used to be some kind of city a long time ago. That looks like a waterfall going down. And not like a city how it is in the middle, but like a big ass. Like Hollow Knight type city. Hollow Nest. Dilapidated, busted ruins. Of what seems to be, was all, used to be awesome. Oh, is this guy who's gonna tell me who the boss is? Four. What the hell is that? What's the eyes on that thing? Wow. This area looks like shit. <clears throat> but oh well. Frog ninjas. Just piling up dead people. And putting their heads on pikes. How nice. How very kind. And skinning them alive and putting them on. Wow. one of the big boys again. At least the arm of one. Looked like he had a sword, so they had weapons. I don't need your fucking attitude, little robot man. But yes, I would like to go this way, thank you.
Should I be breaking those? I don't know. <clears throat> Seems to be the water level. Those look like generators. Glad I checked this way. Boop. Three more to go. I think you need four just to turn on that, you know, to turn on that big pillar at the end of general. I think, and then I, I guess there's like four secret ones and then you can open those doors or something. That's what it looked like. Not to be thought. Let's check this way real quick before we keep going. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so he had a sword, it looks like. Well, the, uh, the diamond dog will tell us what's going on once we reach him. Okay. Checkpoint. <clears throat> Let's get to exploring. What's up, bud? These guys were chased away by the frog douches. They trapped his wife. Oh. And murdered them for their skins. And he's just trying to break his chains at what it looked like. God, why is this all so depressing? Oh, there's a sun or something. Right? Three of them. One of them got took. This guy snuck away. I don't know. He, I guess he was the one who got s snatched then ran away. So, lesson is, these frog guys are assholes. Okay, I'm not going that way. What are those? Like tadpole? Those are neat looking. Looks like like a mechanical head of some kind, like a dog or something.
<laughs> All right, well. I need to find Pink Helmet Man. Oh, shit. Okay, they explode after. Remember that. Nice, you get a lot of med kits right off the bat, but that probably doesn't. Uh... Damn it. Guess they do two damage, so I wasn't paying attention. Oh, but this is fine. Bouncing off every damn thing. Okay. Well. Oh. I don't even need pink helmet guy. Got this shit on lockdown. Boopity boopity. Is that down here already? Oh yeah. Dude. Suck my genitals. Alright, bud. <clears throat> I don't know if I checked the downstairs over there. I'll go ch real quick. I think that's why I was attacked when I went back in there. Because there's more stuff. Yeah, I haven't been down here for show, fo show. That's the first half. Four. Rest of the bridge. Med kit, dope. There's gotta be some over here, right? There's gotta be some. No? Oh, 
Tom. Well, I mean, that worked. It wasn't a very graceful win, but I'll heal. I see. Oh, dude. Well, I'm dead. I'm not dead? This is the wrong way, though. Oh. How did I not die over there. That's how you do it. Professional staff. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm awful at everything. No oh, short kit. It's a short kit. What is that? What else does that do? Oh well, I got some stuff out of the ordeal, the uh, the level up. Come on, man. Cheap ass. I hate you. I hate you. Dude. What the fuck just happened? I swung at him and he dodged through it and killed me. Not only did he kill me, he did three hits of damage and. or something. Horseshit. Garbage. Broken game, literally unplayable. I'm kidding. Come on, damn it. Prick. Not even gonna have that song and dance. He was the last one too and he had like one hit left of course that's always when I die is when at the very fucking end so it's extremely ex frustrating because you get to do all that horse shit over you know, horse shit huh there's like no music over there for some reason Hey, I can open this door. Neat. Let's see what kind of tasty treats we were rewarded with for our hard work. I said tasty treats for our hard work. Hey, achievement. Dummy. Stupid. Oh, because I got that guy to 
run off. Jesus Christ. Okay. This is probably one of the secret ones. Damage or health? Or both? Because I'll take both them up, but... You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Fine, game. You win, alright? I'll take the fucking damage. Shit. <laughs> Well, that was worth it. Dep I don't know. We'll see what that new gear actually is. This, this is water over here, nothing. Okay. Hmm. <coughs> oh, there's. Dodged off the, the thing. Brilliant. Um, hmm. Okay. See, so yeah, I guess I could go this way. Have I been this way? I'll, I'll know when I go outside, probably. Yeah. 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 Well, do I really need to... I th let's see. I may have explored all that needs to be explored down here. So there's this, kill these guys. Did I, open, did I go through here? No. I would have remembered a aquarium with dead people in it. <clears throat> Let's see what kind of sick, twisted shit is up here. Oh, that's nice. Diamond Doge. He knows the way. As usual. Well, hold up. Okay. He always seems to point us towards that dude. We all must be on the same team. Unless we are all... We are all slave to the master, my uh, Diamond Doge. Oh, shit. So you have the... Yeah, he's got the same thing. Helicopter flying by pretty low, also. Alright. Let's explore. Ah, shortcut. Beautiful. Hmm. 
This might be my favorite level. I thought it was going to be all like poison swamp and shit. But it's nice. I mean, downstairs doesn't look so great. It's all machinery and caves, but... It could be worse. How the hell? No, I don't want to... Punk ass bitch. Such a prick. Man, this is... Uh, there's so many ways to go. Down this one little path here. So they throw bombs <clears throat> that shoot at our spread gun pattern, kinda. Oh, another upgrade, dog. to go. That looks like a dead end. Thank God. Get clapped. Oh, there's the thing. Okay, so I'm, I'm going the right way, as far as I'm concerned. Those are just scientist frogs, is that the deal? Ugh. Yeah, I'll heal, why not? The thing? No. Cheap ass. Cheap ass. Like one after another nonstop hitting me in the face and I couldn't. It looks like shit all the way back here, really? Looks like the way poise works in this game is uh you don't have any. So if they hit you before you can get your attack off, you don't get your attack off. trying to dodge uh okay well hello um yeah most times no one's watching the stream but that's fine I mean people jump in 
here and there, but I'm sure. God damn it. People have other th better things to do with, uh, on the weekend. I don't, however. All my plans have been sidelined by my computer fan dying on me. So I can only use my crappy laptop, which is shit, which is what I'm using now. Uh, but anyway, hello. And hope you're having a good weekend. Okay, so here's cheap bastard. Kill that guy, but still take damage. There we go. God damn it. Ran right into it. Stop it. Get away from my medkit, sir. Sir. Thank you. You almost killed me. Um. I don't know. Maybe because it's not Fortnite or League of Legends or uh, what, what else? Whatever else is popular. Uh, something Royale. There's another Battle Royale game people watch a lot. But thank you, I appreciate that. Uh, it is what it is, you know. I'm, I just do this for fun anyway. Sweet. Alright, so we got that done. Feels like there's... Oh, shit. Watch your ears. It gets loud. Damn, that hurts. Yeah, exactly. That's all one can really hope for. Um, but this is just a hobby of mine that I've been doing for about 10 years, I guess. Just recently I decided to stop recording videos, because that's what I used to do, is record stuff and put it on YouTube. And now I just stream it and then export it over to YouTube, because it takes a lot less resources to do it that way. It's a lot easier. So this is just what I've been doing for a long time. You know, this is what I do. Anyway, we got that thing open. God, that was really loud. My head hurts. <laughs> and this goes... I don't think I took this. <clears throat> Let's see where this goes. Back to Hubland? Oh shit. Um, it is. If you scroll down a little bit, there's. You know, I have like all those different panels down there with like, welcome, this is. You know, all that. And one of them is about YouTube. If you click on the. If you click on the YouTube icon picture, it'll it'll take you to my channel. And it's got like th I don't know. I've done so many games over the over the years, and I don't do it well. I started doing it because it was just a hobby, and then some people liked it and started watching me, so they requested me to do other games. So. That's that's mostly what I do now is what people suggest. Um, 
I'm playing this because my main computer broke, so I can't go. I can't play anything I want to. So it's coming off my uh, laptop here. My 10 year old laptop. Oh, shh. Ooh. Ooh. It's like a dead. It's another dead giant thing. Leaking what seems like blood, but who knows, really. insane oh uh, but yeah anyway this is just bit you know long story short this has just been a hobby of mine yeah that's true and I don't know why This needs to be a lot bigger, actually. Alright. Okay, that changed it. So then we'll shrink it down. I'm sorry to cut your message off on the little chat thing that I have, but it's. I just, you know, I just downloaded all this shit on this laptop this morning, so my settings are not perfect. But yeah, um, this is pretty f sweet. It's very confusing. Um, pretty much what you saw from that cutscene just a second ago is as much as I know about what the story is. You know, like following some kind of... Shit. Following a dog, and you gotta... Oh, there's some demon. I don't know. It's, <laughs> it's hard. It's hard to follow. It's super cryptic, but it looks. It's very neat. The art style's neat. The game's neat. Just use the checkpoint. Hmm, okay. Any, any secret stuff? No. Yeah, I uh I killed two bosses. Um But the story is still pretty much, you know, I'm following the wisdom of this dog that I'm following. I don't know if it's wisdom or just following some dog. Because it appeared in, like, it appeared in the fever dream you have at the beginning of the game where there's a bunch of... <laughs> like that giant dead thing that was in the water in the... In the cutscene at the beginning, they're alive for like a second, and they start decaying. And there's a there's like an explosion. <laughs> I don't know, but it looks the game looks cool, plays cool. Hopefully, further along, it'll like really lay out what the story is, because I'm interested. But yeah, it's very it's very cool, very well done game. And the music's neat too. It's just, it's extremely loud is the problem because uh, that cutscene was like blowing my ears out, and these are like my sound settings. Like, you know, I can't really, I, I can't do any better than that. Uh, 
Did I want to buy more heals or what else is there? Oh yeah, the bombs. I didn't even buy the bombs. <clears throat> but yeah, this game does a good job at um, telling a story without saying anything. Uh, yeah. I agree. I agree. It's nice to... It's nice to keep wondering about where the story's going. Until the end. Most stories nowadays are like, uh, you know... Go to point A to, from point A to point B, and then you fight a bad guy. Like, what's... Like Far Cry 5, else, you know, point A to point B, you listen to the monologues of all the bad guys, and then the, the ending was a huge let, let down. Because it just, even though it made sense, it just wasn't a good idea. It's pissed a lot of people off. Alright, so, about that upgrade thing. Um, shit. But yeah, uh, I, I agree with you. I like games that, you know, they don't, they don't, they're not going to flat out tell you what's going on. But throughout the course of the story, you know, you find pieces that put things together. It's, it's more of a rewarding experience, like you're actually accomplishing something. When all you're really doing is picking up the clues that the developers laid out for you. The more chances you get to make the player feel better about themselves during the video game you're making, the better. Uh... Oh, so... Here's, here's the general gist of it. This is like the world map. If you look up to the top left of the screen, it's got the little icon, it's got a diamond, and the top three are filled. Well, each of these sections... See up there, it changed to, it's got like a diamond in one of the squares, or one of the little corners is purple. Each of these little diamonds here is like a thing you pull out of the ground to power up the area. And once you get four, you go to the boss, fight the boss, and then past him is, uh, you turn on like this pillar just progresses the game I guess it's just a it, it opens up like little pathways throughout the world um, but I already got the four that I had without getting this one there's also like this guy that you talk with, with he has like a purple or a pink helmet I say talk there's no actual dialogue in the game it's just pictures but he, he points out all these places to you when you arrive and you find him so I was able to get the four before getting these because I had enough collectibles, quote unquote, in the game to go through a secret passage and find a hidden one of those things. I don't know how to get over. My problem is I can't really read the map. I don't. I don't get it. I don't know. I think I want to go up. Uh, I want to go northeast to where that thing is, to the boss. <sighs> oh shit. Not these ass jacks. <clears throat> I already did this crap. Man, this guy's annoying. Oops. You also have a gun, but I'm terrible at aiming it. Oh, I got him. Shit. Before I took one to the face. See, I'm gonna go like this way, I think. Yeah. Yeah. I've. Yeah.
And it sucks because that's... That above... This above head map I can kind of understand. This one is like the underground. And it's got these lines that... Like I don't... This I have no idea what I'm looking at. This one, the one on top, I can kinda see what's going on, but the uh, the underground one, I don't. I have no idea. Oh shit! I was already over here. See, but I want to get over here, man. Maybe I can. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Those are the um. Those are the things I was talking about, like in the beginning of the game. You see a cutscene of these big giants and they, they just die all of a sudden. And that's one of them. It is pretty creepy. But it is super dead. Or whatever. I hope so. I don't know, the cutscene... I don't know. The story... The cutscene in the beginning of the game made it seem like you were there when this was happening. Yeah. It's like a... yeah. It was, it was like... You were there when this was happening or something, but it looks like those things have been dead for a while, so I don't... Uh, and I don't know how to get over here. Guess we'll go back down. Oh, that would be neat. Because, yeah, the pretty much all you see of them is they're they're either dead, or, you know, like the two seconds in the beginning cutscene is all you see of them. So, but yeah, that'd be cool. Um. Okay. This might be kind of the right way. But I think I was over here already. Yeah, by this totem pole head thing. So now the problem is I'm going to get super lost trying to find the one way to go. To open the door to the boss. Pretty sure I've been down here, but we'll... We'll see. So far, the bosses have been... I don't know. Pretty unique. One, guy's a, one, was, one guy was a melee guy. The other guy was a... Uh, caster, like magic bird. But they all seem to, like, summon in people to help them fight. See? Shoot. I've already been down here. Now it's gonna make me fight all this crap again. Which I don't really want to. I don't want to fight all this stuff. I just want to get to the, uh... Where the boss is. Alright. Come on! I was killing them good. Man, that's a hell of a thing. But I've already... The problem is I've already been to these places. Here. Been up here. Killed all these guys. Um, 
Maybe not. This doesn't seem too familiar up here. No, I have been here. See, these are the things that I'm looking for. You pull these out of the ground and they power up. They power up the little symbol on the top left. Where it's like the diamond. Purple diamond that's like kind of strobing. But now I just need to find the boss door. That seems to be easier said than done, however. <clears throat> Freaking gauntlet room. Oh, so I remember all this shit. God, I'm like, I can't see where I am. Alright. Um. There's a guy that, in the beginning of when you get to all these areas, there's a guy that shows you like a little screen shot or a little piece of artwork of the boss. But it was like a big... The other ones I could, you could tell is like a, a bird mage and a tiger with a sword. <clears throat> but this, the one we're going for here, I don't know, look like just nothing a big blob of stuff. There we go. <clears throat> cool. See, and this is the door I went through because I, because throughout the game there's these keys you can pick up and they're like collectibles. Um... Nice. And those right there that I just picked up is like an upgrade. When you get four of those, it gives you like a chip and you can go to the town and buy new abilities. But, um, so yeah, I went up here with the Aquarium of Dead People. This seems like, this really seems like it would be the entrance to the boss because it's super atmospheric thematic but let me check the map no like I'm all the way down here now not all the way over there um I'll go find the guy and whoops I didn't get around the I'll see if I can find the guy oh I'm dying I think he stays there until you beat the boss. <sighs> Whoops. Well, heal that up real quick. Should be like right down here. He was like chilling next to a tree. Oh, here's the arm of another one of those giant things. Oh no, this is the wrong way. <clears throat> 